Students often get mixed up when it comes to how oxygen and carbon dioxide actually moves across the alveolar membrane. Now see this question on your screen. Question is, in alveoli, the primary reason for oxygen moving into the blood and carbon dioxide moving out is? Now to answer this question, you should firstly know the concept of exchange of gases. Now in human body, the gaseous exchange happens mainly between the alveoli and pulmonary capillaries. Now let's talk about the exchange of oxygen. In alveoli, the partial pressure of oxygen is about 104 mm of Hg, whereas in deoxygenated blood, it's only around 40 mm of Hg. Now this creates a diffusion gradient. So oxygen moves from alveoli to blood. Now diffusion continues until partial pressure of the oxygen in the blood rises to match the alveolar level. This is around 104 mm of Hg. For carbon dioxide, the alveolar partial pressure is 40 mm of Hg, while in blood coming from the tissues, it's around only 45 mm of Hg. Now this gradient is much smaller. So carbon dioxide is 20 times more soluble in plasma than oxygen. So still diffusion rapidly happens from blood to alveoli. Now the correct answer of this above question is option B, differences in the partial pressure of gases. Now see this question on your screen and answer the correct option in the comment section. I hope you like this video. For more such question based learning, subscribe to our Extra Marks Need channel and also visit extramarks.com.